Walker, as you said. I would not be upset well, about it. What what about the number one draft pick, Macca? I I just like to see him just play a few SAFL games. I just don't think I would. I just I have this horrible memory to what we did to Mackesy. And what I'd like to do is is uh, see our uh, number one pick. That's what number two actually was, but our number no, one pick. I um, call him number one because the other one was a bloody. Um, yeah, that was so to make sure we yeah burn up their uh, draft picks. Um, yep. I'd like to see him play maybe four or five games at SAFL level. And, uh, why? T- tell me why, look, Matt. Tell me why. Yep. To bring a confident player into the game. But, he, so that... but he played SAFL pretty much all last year. He's proven Even... to play against men. He is not going to learn one single thing, not one single thing, playing in the twos. I didn't. I didn't say he would. I just want him to come. Uh, he should be able to dominate at the SAFL level, and I'd like to bring him in while he's doing that. Yeah, no, I disagree a hundred percent. Actually, disagree. Oh. I would have Riley Tilthorpe in the side. Uh, in your selected side, I would have him in place of Tom Lynch, um, and I would have him. Uh, Got, uh, swapping through with um, Frampton up forward, uh, maybe a, a, a tiny run uh, in the guts as a as a chop out, but would probably leave that to Frampton or Himmelberg, whoever. Um, but I, I want Riley Tilthorpe in the, in the side. I think what he showed, uh, the glimpses that he showed in the preseason, um, give me enough confidence that he can compete at the level. And I'll tell you what, the other thing, Mac, uh, Geelong's Achilles here were their defence. Uh, they've lost Henderson and Harry Taylor. Uh, so they've got a new configuration um, down back. And I would like to put some, if we can, I would like to put some selection pressure on them as well. And having Tilthorpe, Frampton and um, uh, O'Brien in the, in the team, I think... Uh, just puts a little bit of selection pressure on them. It, it's proactive on our behalf, and uh, when it comes to Riley, I think you, he's not Fisher. He's not Fisher Mackesy. He is not Fisher Mackesy. Fisher Mackesy didn't play against men before he was drafted. Riley has um, has played for twelve months against men and done well. I think. I think he needs to be in. I sincerely hope they play Riley Thilthorpe. I really do. Uh, I think he deserves it, and I think it would cause... Uh, imagine all all Riley Thilthorpe has to do if he debuts against Geelong is take one strong grab. That's all what? he has to do for the whole game. If he takes one strong, strong grab and kicks a sausage and everyone gets around him, I think that's exactly what the team needs from a young kid and uh, I, I hope that Matthew Nix shows a bit of faith and uh, selects him. I really do. Well, I know we've got nothing to lose, Fiend, because we're not, when you look at uh, well, our right. team, uh, you look at our team versus the other, other teams in the competition, uh, we, we're just a mob of kids, really. I mean, there's about half and half. You know, you've got half that are probably uh, established league players and half of them are still trying to establish themselves as league players. Yeah. So uh, it's going to be another one of those seasons for us and uh, we may win a few more games and when the days when everything clicks and we do everything right, um, but there's also going to be some terrible days as well and we're prepared for that. Um, so I know what you're saying and... and you, you could be right and I could be wrong. I, I, it's just, just one of those things. I don't know. I, mm. I'm probably erring on the side of caution and that's all. Yeah. But look, and I think in days gone past you might have been right, but we're in a rebuild, Mac, and we've got to show faith in these young kids. And I think Riley is our number one pick. He's the future of the club up forward. Um, we have to show faith. We have to show faith. Get him in. But running around in the twos actually does nothing for him not one thing he's done it all before he's done it already um now let's just talk quickly about fisherman